Okay. Let's try again. I'm gonna save up here so I don't have to run up the stupid tube every time I lose. Okay, where is a good place to sit then? Okay, you know what we're gonna do? Garrus? Oh, you've already triggered them, jerk face. No, Shepard, I actually want you to hit these things. Oh, they're coming from the other side. No. Oh. Oh, shit! Get out of my face! Uh. Tally, can you overload him? Overload him, please. Get him, get him, get him. Oh my god, another one? Run, Shepard. Damn it. <sighs> okay, you know what we're gonna do? I have an idea. It's probably not exactly a brilliant one, but I don't care. We're going to trigger them. Hey guys, I'm over here. Do you see me yet? Now we're gonna run back in here. Okay, get back inside. That should at least give me some... I think that'll make the destroyer separate out. Because they should come after me. Come on, guys. Yeah, great. Come over here. Where are they? Come down here. Oh, here come some. Okay, okay. Get the destroyer. Aha! Aha! Uh, let's throw a singularity. Come on. Stop with the overheating stuff. Okay. Negative contacts. Oh, good. I'm sure there's more outside, but at least this thinned the herd a little bit. And the destroyers, because those were my main problem. Okay. Hide, please. Where are they? There's one dancing over there. Okay. Explode that. Get the stupid sniper. Where are the rest of you? Where are my companions? Oh, they're just standing around like dum-dums. Hello? Would you care to show yourself in such a way that I can actually hit you? Alright. You try, Garrus. You... You go get him. Okay. What's left? Oh, hey, this guy. Are we dead? Everyone gone? Perimeter clear. Yay! Okay. I swear, this was the worst possible place to fight them. If I had entered from that side, it would have been much easier. Okay. Let's leave. Open. Okie dokie. Open this. And out we go. Out we go. Hooray! This is fun. Okay. Exit the mine. Area map updated. What about it? I don't know, but we've got... We've got an anomaly and some debris left. Hi, monkey. I don't need you anymore. I already found what I'm looking for. Alright, where's this debris? It's, uh, down this way. Don't drive over any monkeys. That's not very nice. No! Go. Alright. Wee. Here we go. There's debris. I'm just gonna have to freaking climb a mountain or something. Let's try getting it from this side. That should be an easier climb. Where is it? Is it really down here in this little hole? Yep, it's down there in the little hole. 
Okay. Step. Step. Back. There we go. Quit. Get out. And this. Go, go, ah! Ha, I did it! Oh no! Oh, okay, it's... Go away, I can't see what there is. Thank you. Take all. That just means that I'm gonna have to empty my inventory soon. I'll do that next time. I don't care enough to do it right now. Okay, we've still got the anomaly left. But the anomaly requires climbing lots of mountains. Oh, my favorite. Let's do this thing, mountain. Ah, uh, come on. Turn a little bit so you can get some traction. No, turn a little bit. Thank you. Go, go, go. Don't fall off. Don't fall off. Okay, okay. No! Okay, just up this little bit here. Ah! Go! You're almost there! I hate climbing mountains. Alright. Let me see. Where is this stupid anomaly? Oh, there's just something to... to survey, search, whatever. What have you. Let's stay on top of the mountain. Is this thing gonna make me jump down? If it is, I'm gonna say... Forget you, I'll come back for you later. Where is it? Oh man, I hate this planet. Oh, is that it? Right there? Okay. Stop. Will I be able to get out here? No. How about now? There we go. Excuse me. Survey. Survey, mineral. Oh, go! There we go. Heavy metal surveyed. You have successfully surveyed a large deposit of palladium. Okay, good. I'm very pleased to hear that. Stop, 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 stop. You're gonna fall off. You're gonna fall off. Okay. Now I have to figure out where I'm supposed to go. Where is this stupid anomaly? It better be worth it. Alright, well at least we've got some smooth train up here. Where is this anomaly? It's more like that way. Right? This way? No. It's a complete opposite direction. So, it's like this way? This way. Okay. Got it. Across these little peaks here? Okay, if you say so. If you say so, map. Actually, I would rather not have a talking map. Especially if it's the one from Dora the Explorer. That thing is creepy. Alright, let's see. Around here. Oh, don't fall off! Don't fall off! Oh my goodness. <laughs> this would be fun to climb again. Okay. No. Careful. We're turning around slowly. Now, if you fall off, I'm going to be so mad. I'm going to be so, so mad. Don't, don't, don't you... I'm restraining myself. You better get back up there. What is this? What is this, Mako? Seriously. Ugh. Now it's gonna fly down even further. Look what you did. Why is this stupid anomaly on top of the mountain anyway? I have to climb up to it again. At least this part isn't too steep. Or at least steep in such a way that I can climb it easily. If you fall again... 
We're gonna have a big problem here. Oh, look. That thing. Go! Go! I bet that's the anomaly. Because it looks like one. I don't know much about how anomalies look, but I imagine that they look like this. Alright, let's get out. Oh, it's a Prothean Ruin! Recover. Recover artifact. And we recover Prothean artifacts the same way that we recover everything else. Mysterious globe. <laughs> okay, examine. Examining the strange Prothean artifact uh, reveals a small irregular slot on the underside of the surface. Remembering the strange trinket you received from the Asari consort on the Citadel, why would you remember that of all things? You pull it out and place it into the slot. The ball explodes in a brilliant flash of white light, momentary blind momentarily blinding and disorienting you. Yeah, Shepard, this sounds like a very stupid idea. Slowly your senses return as you wake from a deep sleep. You are alone in the forest, though you are not far from the caves you share with the others of your tribe. There is a pain and a small lump in the back of your skull, as if a chip of flint has been forced under the surface of the skin. Leaning on your bone-tipped spear for support, you rise to your feet. A sound draws your attention upwards, where a strange creature hover hovers high above you. It is unlike the birds you've hunted by the lake's edge. It has no head and no wings, yet somehow it flies. It is a beast of shining silver, hanging motionless in the sky like a cloud. You sense it is watching you, studying you. Oh, that's creepy. Oh, we've got more. Raising a hairy fist, oh great, I have a hairy fist now, you shake your spear at it in anger and the creature rises up quickly until it disappears from view. With a satisfied grunt, oh yes, rah, you make your way back to the caves and the rest of the tribe. You fall into the familiar patterns of life, the hunt for food, the struggle to claim and keep a mate, yes, that's definitely me, <laughs> the battles against other tribes that would claim your territory. Days roll into nights and back into days. Each time you rise, your s rise. Oh, each time you rise from sleep, there is a s the sensation that you are not alone. That some other is with you, sharing all you see, hear, and feel. That's really creepy. At these times, your hand goes to the strange lump at the back of your skull, and you remember the silver creature in the sky. The air grows colder. Winter falls. You must range farther for food clutching the furs tight against you to ward off the chill. It is on one of these long hunts that the strange bird returns. You hear it before you can see it. It's, def it's call a deafening roar as it descends from above, swooping down on you. A single great eye opens on the underbelly, a glowing red orb. You try to run, but a finger of red light extends from the eye and engulfs you, and all goes black again. Ooh, creepy story. You wake an instant later to find yourself on Elitania, lying on your back, the Prothean artifact looming above you undamaged, and your companions standing over you. They help you to your feet puzzled. There was a flash of light, um, and you just sort of toffled over, one explains. Are you okay, Shepard? The other asks. Uh, somehow I imagine that that first one <laughs> was Garrus and the second one is Tally. Um, you don't answer right away, wondering at the implications of what you have been, what you have seen. The memories of a Cro-Magnon hunter, captured and implanted, ca or captured by an implanted Prothean data recorder. How long did they study the primitive humans, observing them and analyzing the results at their base on Mars? And what, if anything, did they learn from us? I'm fine, you finally reply, realizing that this is a mystery you will probably never solve. Forget about it. Ooh, creepy story. Let's leave. Let's leave. Okay. Well, that was that was actually a cool anomaly. I'm glad I climbed the mountain for it. Return to the Normandy. Woo! Okay. Well, at this point, I think I'm going to go ahead and stop. Wait. Let's trigger. Can I trigger hack it? I got your data thingy, Majigger. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Let me see. No, get out of that! How many things do I have to click through? Journal. Assignments. 
There we go. Okay, it's done. Cool. Okay, so um, I'm going to go ahead and stop here. Next time we'll start by selling stuff and I guess equipping Ashley with the million and two pieces of heavy human armor that I've picked up. Um, but yeah, so until then, I um, hope you enjoyed this set and I hope you'll join me next time for more Mass Effect with side quests and selling and all kinds of lovely stuff. So until then, goodbye everyone.